Hello everyone. The story I'm going to read now is called Who's in the Loo? and is written by Jean Willis. Who's in the loo? There's a very long queue. Look at everyone waiting. Is it an elephant having a poo? They're taking forever. Now, who could it be? A whale who's doing the world's biggest wee? Is it a tiger who needed a tittle? A wandering wombat who wanted a whittle. A waddling penguin too frozen to piddle. <laughs> oh, this is a funny bit. Is it a rhino who had a hot curry? It could be a tortoise. Well, they never hurry. Whoever it is, it's a bit of a worry. Perhaps it's a hamster who can't reach the seat. Or maybe a monkey who's washing his feet. Or a snake who's just sitting there sucking a sweet. Perhaps it's a poor velvety mole who reached for the paper and fell down the bowl and is bobbing about like a damp bit of coal. <laughs> Has a hippo's fat bottom got wedged in the pan? Is it a rat being sick? And after eating a flan, or a cat is sailing its catamaran. Who's in the loo? That's what we'd like to know. And why are they being so terribly slow? We're all getting desperate. It's our turn to go. Is it a crocodile clipping his nails? Is it a school of skunks washing their tails? Or is it a co coach load of elderly snails? Oh goodness. Perhaps it's a sloth who has fallen asleep, or is it a shepherd who's dipping his sheep, or a leopard who's changing his spots? Have a peek.
Here's this dog who's made a stink. Whew. For a pig who's washing his pants in the sink. Goodness. Perhaps it's a porpoise. Well, what do you think? Who's in the loo? We just haven't a clue. Bang on the door. It's all we can do. We've heard a small voice. I said, I'm in the loo. I'm just doing what my mum told me to do. But it takes me forever. No one understands. Who is it? Oh, it was an octopus washing his eight little hands. <laughs> and there he is. And that's the end of the story. Who's in the loo? That's a bit of a cheeky book, isn't it? See you next time. Bye.